So your understanding when you spoke with her on Friday was that she was doing this for the Republican Absolutely. Party? Absolutely. She was doing this as a matter of we need to have someone who's going to caucus with the Republicans, who's going to vote against the Pelosi's big government uh, legislation and uh, and who was a real fiscal conservative and that's why and that's why she did what she did she suspended her campaign but then she went on to endorse the Democrat Bill Owens which you have you in your statement responding to it called a betrayal to the North Country and to the Republican Party what happened in that period of time I call it White House Chicago style thuggery they went after her every way they could. Uh, and she was, at that time, when she spoke to me on Saturday, the next morning, she was in fact sobbing, uh, sobbing uh, because of all the emotions of the good decision that she had made to step out. Uh, she was very upset by that. She was scared she would lose her seat in the assembly, very scared about losing her seat in the assembly. And in comes the White House and, and preyed on her at that time. Of, of vulnerability, along with uh, Andrew Cuomo did the same thing, and, uh, and uh, Sheldon Silver did the same thing, and June O'Neill, her good friend, then came along and, uh, and played the good cop uh, to the others who were saying the things that they would say what they, in order to, to make her come out and, and endorse Owens 